Good morning, welcome to the vineyards. My name's Dave from the pastor here. Uh, it's going to be slightly different this morning, as you can see from the layout. Uh, I've done things slightly differently. Uh, I need a child who is under 11. Come and help me. So, who come help me? Who choose an age? It's four weeks to Easter. Come and pick one. We've had this one already. So this one's broken. This one's been broken into. We need to choose the colour. You see if you can break into it and find out what's inside. What's the child doing? Two creamers. You can eat one, you've got to give one to a friend. Okay? You've got a friend here today? Yeah? And can you read out the joke? Why did the Easter egg hide? He was a little chicken. <laughs> so you can take the eggs, you can leave the shower in there, and we're done. Uh, do I do a projector? Click. Down the next one. So kids' quest today is a uh, galaxy egg. If you were to drive 100 miles an hour around the wings of Saturn, how many days would it take for you? So if you can work that out, then you can find the answer. You can write your name. If you're under 12, you can write your name out by the door on the kids' quest, and maybe you'll win the egg. Uh, last week's was, which UK city is also a place on the moon? Did you know this? Anyone know the answer to this? It was Birmingham. There's a crater called Birmingham on the moon. Not named after the city, but named after a person called Birmingham. So, so this morning we're going to do things slightly differently because we haven't got enough people for a kids' photo. So what we're going to do is we're going to do some activities where we would normally do a talk. So we have worship to start with, a couple of notices, and then we're going to do some activities to bless the community for Mother's Day. So if you have a mother you're going to see today, you can make up one of these, which is a little ice cream carton. You can colour the, the words and say, Happy Mother's Day, tell that to your mum. But if you can do two, you can give out one to somebody else. Either we walk in from here, out to the, the, the uh, houses around here, or you can take it home with you. If you have a next door neighbour, you think we'll be really be blessed by that. So it's an outreach Sunday today to actually make these up, all the flowers on the table there. Uh, we're going to make up these instead of the talk today. So you can grab a table later. You can grab a couple of pens, you can grab a carton and a flower and you can make something up either for your mum or and or for somebody else you think will be really blessed by some flowers on Mother's Day. There are some people on site, there are some cricketers on site who are blessed. There is also a caretaker somewhere around in the car park at the top. Someone can go and bless him and say, are you going to see your mum today? Would you like to see this to your mum? Okay. We also have the market for Mendes today. So we've got some wooden uh, goods all the way from Malawi which we are selling off for uh, Mendes, who, are, who we are sending, or who has been sent, to law school in Mozambique. We're sponsoring him this year, and we have some uh, wooden goods and other items from Malawi. You can buy those today. We even have a card room you can use if you want to. If you don't have your card or any cash on you today, then you can give us an IOU, and we can, you can feel free to take, you can take one, something for your mum if you want to. Find something there. But we do need to raise money for, Malawi, for Mozambique, for Mendes in Mozambique to send you to law school this year. So why don't you stand up and we're going to pray before we kick off with the worship. <clears throat> Heavenly Father, send your Holy Spirit this morning, Lord, as we remember that it's Mother and Sunday. We remember that you care for us like a, a hen looking after her chicks. Like a hen brewing over eggs. And it's all about eggs today, this morning, but Lord, with the eggs in the basket, we can approach an Easter. We are looking towards that image of you caring for us as a mother. Holy Spirit, come and mother us this morning. Come and bring us into that place where we can relax, we can feel secure, we can feel safe under your wings as we bless you, Lord. We bless you. Come, Holy Spirit. Thank you. 
then we're going to crack on with the flowers. So if you, this is your first visit to us, huge, huge welcome. We're so thrilled you come with us today. Uh, just a few things you might want to know is that we have a come as you are policy, so you don't have to be anybody that you're not, just relax. We love newcomers. Lift the sound away from the screen, you'll see what it actually says. <laughs> I'm talking to Craig. <laughs> We want you to feel completely welcome here and uh, completely one of the family. Uh, we have newcomers packs, uh, black envelopes out by the lobby. We also have some travel mugs and kids bottles. If you come and you haven't had a coffee yet, we'll give you a travel mug to take with you. And also if you've got kids or grandkids, you can take a, a, kid, a kids bottle. And if you could fill out a feedback card, that'd be fantastic. We'd like to know whether we're kind of like, you know, uh, Trusting with issues with uh, newcomers. So if you can fill out details, card, just let us know how you found your first experience with us. That will be fantastic. Thank you. If you want to become a member here, we don't have a, a membership scheme as is. We ask you to do five things. So come along on a Sunday. You've done one of the five already. Join a small group. Details coming up. Serve on a Sunday. There's a voter out for April at the moment. Keep regularly, there's a basket in the middle there to give some money and then invite your friends along or do some outreach, that kind of thing, to encourage people outside of church to, to, to see what we do inside. So click. Uh, so the voter's out today, it's on the website. So you can go onto the website and look at the voter for April. Click. Uh, today we're going to do some outreach. So if you, if you don't have to hang around if you don't want to, this is out of your comfort zone, please don't worry about that. So cool. Or if you're not particularly arty, that's not an issue either. Uh, but just would like you to know that you can take some flowers. Every like every female, every lady this morning gets to take some flowers with her. So we let, even if you're a mum, if you're not a mum, if your children are here, if your children aren't here, please do take uh, a pot with flowers in it to bless you for Mother's Day. Uh, we're going to give out some around the school here if we get a chance, or take some home with you to your neighbours and your friends, anyone you can think of to bless. Everybody's got a non-Christian friend or a pre-Christian friend they can bless with some flowers today. Uh, take them home to your mum, uh, or you can leave here right at the time if you want to, that's not a problem. Please don't feel obliged to do this, but it's a way to actually reach out 
to the community around us. We want to do things slightly different to take you to a point where you can bless other people. Thank you. I said the market for windows is today down the end there where Josh is standing. Lots of uh, wooden goods and items from Malawi. Please do have a look through and see what you can afford today. It all goes to a very, very good cause. Click. We are still in the throes of COVID. We've had another issue this morning with COVID. So please do bear in mind that things may change, still attend to the last minute. I know the restrictions end on Thursday, but bear in mind that COVID is still a thing, it's still around, and we're still you know, dealing with that. If things change at the last minute, do uh, bear with us. Click. Uh, Lego Cup tomorrow, 4.15, at the Grange Church. Uh, anyone is welcome. So we say four to 104 Lego is made for. Uh, but if you've got uh, primary age kids, that's probably the best day to it's aimed at. I think it's a marble run tomorrow, isn't it? Marble runs tomorrow, yeah, cool. Click. Oh, oh. Uh, lunch is on Tuesday, that's for current leaders. So if you're currently leading a group or some area of church, we'll get together on Tuesday. We'll let you know whether it's in person or online uh, uh, as we approach Tuesday evening. Click. And knitting is on this Wednesday at the Lodge, Rayleigh Lodge, of, of this, if he's on 70 in the chase, in Rayleigh, from the, on top of the hill in Rayleigh. Uh, if you want to go on for that, bring your needles, or come along and use what's going to be there, I do believe. So, click. Uh, right, that's this week's groups on now. 24-7 prayer is on, youth group is on, youth group is at base jump on Friday, ladies breakfast on Saturday. Ladies breakfast this Saturday at Roba at 9 o'clock. Some groups, school groups, will be closing over restart, some won't be. So please have a chat with your leader and find out which ones are open and which ones are not. Over the Easter holidays, which begin next Friday. Click. I think that's it. Oh no, Easter holidays. There we go. I say it's about small groups. We are away during the Easter holidays, so if you have a crisis, don't come to us basically. Find somebody that you can go and have a crisis with if anything happens over Easter. We'll have to take a few days off. Uh, please bear that in mind uh, that. <laughs> After the ravages of COVID in church, COVID in school, COVID in Rayleigh, it's taken a bit of a toll on us, so we're taking a few days off as from after next Sunday. Next Sunday we're here, and after next Sunday. I think that's the last one, isn't it? Yeah, okay, yeah. cool. Brilliant. Okay, so you, if, you're stay, if you're hanging around, please hang, with us, hang around with us. You need to grab yourself a white pot and the things that Laura's cutting up, which is the uh, banner that goes on your pot and it wraps around. We're going to glue that on. So go and sit yourself at a table with some flowers and some pens, and we get to find some glue, and we'll sort that out as for now. Excellent. One, two, three, four. We might even have another table out, possibly. Do we have another table? If people want to sit at tables, that would be fantastic, and we'll bring them around to you. Excellent. Oh, sorry. Thought you finished. Does that make sense? <laughs> Everyone know what they're doing? Hand up if you're not sure. I, I, I think it is finished. I'm sorry, I'm not. Yeah, but he's muted anyway. Okay, fair enough. What's this one? Rainy Vineyard Sunday. Switched it on, switched it on. Sorry. I really can't hear. Uh, shuffle play. You will need to move and sit at a table if this is going to work. Okay? Why don't you grab yourself a coffee before you do? So you need a white ice cream carton, you need a banner, you need pens to colour in. And after you've done that, you'll need a little plastic bag to put your flowers in, put them in the pot. And if you are, if you're taking this to your mum, great. If you're not, you can leave one on the side. If you can do two each as an average, that would be fantastic. Then you can keep one and then you can give one away to somebody else. 